Hi guys, welcome back to my channel and this is a perfect reply, I mean this is a nose cut or a perfect reply or it can say it's a perfect punch to the media people and also to this unwanted reports that have been raised against the Hispan continuance case. Yes, now recently on January 15 today, the Hispan has filed in an application regarding this news in the stock exchanges as you can see here. Recently, there have been some unsubstantiated and irresponsible press or social media speculation. The first line itself devastated all the things and all the, I would say, the negativeness involved in it, guys. Because recently, this share has fallen so much and we are also requesting our friends to hold this share. If, if in morning, if you have sold this share at 36 rupees, then you have earned so much losses, guys, because when the market was ended, it was ending at 40 rupees. So, see the difference, guys. It is regularly done for big players to buy and sell at higher prices. But as retailers, you are going to fear because that is general, guys. Because uh, as a retail investor, people will feel that uh, if the share price decreases so, uh, decreases so much, then I will earn more losses. That like people think and sell their shares. But they will use, use that time. And they, will share, and they will buy the share guys and they have also said guys this release is being issued to assure see guys to assure all our customers on S bank I mean the customers who are related to S bank recently this problem has happened reports stating that S bank liquidity problem depositors, depositors are not depositing money in S bank all the deposit has been withdrawn so it is a perfect punch to the media people and this is the latest update we can know about the S bank and they also said that as per the latest news of S bank they are saying that their bank overall capital adequacy ratio is comfortably above the regulatory requirements what that mean guys to in order to run a bank the capital is very very important as whether it is adequate adequate means it is sufficient enough so the Reserve Bank of India, I mean the Reserve Bank of India is an official regulator as they mentioned here. They have set a point, I mean they have set 8% the is the figure. Now this bank is above the figure guys, it is 8.7 and the limit is 8. If they raise this fund then they may get 9 point something as a capital adequacy ratio and they are affirming that there is no doubt on capital adequacy ratios and all efforts or being to make financially strengthen the bank even further this point is enough for me guys all i always say we always trust the yes bank management and also the ceo of the company and this is a perfect reply we have been uh, received from yes bank and also you know yesterday we have raised uh, two letters to yes bank regarding this uh, issue and I, I hope a lot of people have also mailed this issue i think so guys and they have done possible things what they could do guys and we are still expecting and as per our latest report we have on the yes bank we are saying we have a strong target of 53 rupees in this share 53 rupees would be the best level to be the yes bank share guys because this 30 or 40 levels would not be enough because it is the fourth largest private bank in india as we have also mentioned and they are the most technologically advanced bank in India. So guys, I hope this news has helped you a lot. Then why not help us by sharing this video. And don't forget to subscribe my channel for more videos like this. And more updates coming soon to you guys. Don't miss it.